six of Earth's neighboring planets will briefly appear in the sky on the same night. Seeing a few planets visible in the sky isn't necessarily rare. Every year, there are multiple instances of conjunctions in which two planets appear close together from our point of view on Earth. The most common of these is a conjunction between Venus and Mercury due to their short orbits, which make them more likely to align with each other. In some cases, more than two planets enter the picture. When four or five planets align, becoming visible to the naked eye, it becomes a full-fledged planet parade. These events don't always happen every year, which is why 2025 is so special for having two major parades. The celestial gathering, last seen in February, will appear in the eastern sky about an hour before sunrise. Although most of these planets have been visible in the morning sky for weeks, Mercury will join the fray, bringing the planet count from five to six. This month's show feels like cosmic choreography planets gathering for a brief, beautiful moment before drifting off on their own orbits again. Blink, and they're gone. Stay up for it, and you might carry that view for years. Starting Sunday, August 17, six planets Mercury, Venus, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune will gather in the eastern sky about an hour before sunrise, hanging around through Wednesday, August 20. Astronomers call it a planet parade, though unlike the Macy's version, you'll need a telescope to spot some of the more elusive floats. This rare planetary parade will be visible in the eastern sky before sunrise for a few days, offering a great opportunity for sky watchers. The first act of the six-planet planet parade that's building in the eastern sky before sunrise. Best seen about an hour before sunrise, bright planets Venus and Jupiter, now beginning to draw away from each other, will dominate in the east while Saturn brightens in the south. Rising below Venus and Jupiter is Mercury, which will get higher each morning this week. Uranus and Neptune will also be in the sky, though neither is visible to the naked eye. Under clear skies, you should be able to spot Venus, Jupiter, and Saturn. Mercury will be closer to the horizon, but still bright enough to be seen by most observers. However, Uranus, appearing between Jupiter and Saturn in the sky, and Neptune, close to Saturn in the sky, are too dim and distant to be seen with the naked eye. The only way to see these two ice giants is by using a good telescope. The planetary parade will last for several days, but the best viewing window is in the early morning hours before sunrise. While Mercury, Venus, Jupiter, and Saturn are typically visible to the naked eye, Uranus and Neptune will require a telescope for optimal viewing, according to live science. The planetary parade will last for several days, but the best viewing window is in the early morning hours before sunrise. When using binoculars or telescopes to observe the planets, especially close to sunrise, be extremely careful to avoid looking directly at the sun, as it can cause serious eye damage.